Hey guys, I'm looking at a keyboard mouse combo from Thermaltake. It is the TT Esports. Uh, it does have the illuminated keyboard and mouse in blue, which I think is really, really great. Uh, the bottom has the little flip up stands to raise the keyboard up, put it at an angle, which is typical. It is spill resistant. It has a somewhat rubberized texture on the face uh, or surrounding the key area and the palm area. And it has a rougher texture on the four corners. It has the blue illuminated lights here and underneath, underneath all of the keys. And you, of course, have your function key and your Windows lock key. That works great. Uh, you can switch the W, S, A, and D functionality uh, to make them into arrow keys. And, of course, there's the arrow keys and W, S, A, and D on the actual arrows. Uh, you can adjust the, bright, the brightness of the lights by holding down the function key and hitting the page up or page down. Uh, same thing, of course, with the function keys on the top across the F1 through F12. You have different shortcuts, media keys, and things of that nature. Um, overall, you know, with the, with the metal look, the rubberized texture, the blue illuminated lighting, and the range of adjustment, you have a really nice keyboard. Um, it feels good. It has a mechanical sound to the keys, which is nice. It's kind of, you know, kind of that retro feel if you're familiar with the older mice. Uh, included with the keyboard is this really sweet mouse. It is lightweight, so that may be a factor for some, but it has a nice contour. It has sort of a rubberized texture. The dragon illuminated and the two sides illuminated in blue LEDs. You have your DPI on the fly switching, your forward and back buttons. Of course, your typical right and left uh, mouse click with the rubberized texture, the nice feel to the wheel as far as scrolling and clicking. Um, it doesn't offer the left to right um, functionality, but that is to be expected for the price of this combo at $30. Uh, you can't really expect everything. There is a braided long cable on the keyboard and on the mouse, so that should help you know, keep that in good working order for you. Uh, gold tipped connections it appears, and that would be matching of course to the actual piece here. Um, let me see, turn off this light, maybe you get a little better idea. There's off, on, and that is off brightness advancing. So you have about three levels before off it looks like. Um, the mouse doesn't have any kind of adjustment, no programmable keys. Uh, there's no software to download. There is a PDF document that I linked to in the text portion. So, you know, the mouse is what it is as far as the options available. But, you know, basic functionality is there. Uh, for gaming, if you like a lightweight mouse, this is great. If you like a heavy mouse, it may not be for you. But as a whole, and for the price, the package is a really, really nice package. It looks good, it works really well, and it's from Thermaltake, who have a, a good reputation for manufacturing good products from uh, my experience in the last, uh, I'll say, 10, 15 years that I've been involved in the uh, computer IT uh, industry, okay? So I just want to give you guys a real quick look. Thanks for watching.